Hello. Hello. Yes. Good morning, sir. How are you doing today? Oh, I'm doing okay. I gotta tell you, Marty. Sometimes when I go for a walk, it seems like all I run into are stupid people on the street. There was a guy with a cell phone taped to his head. I don't mean it was one of those things where it's like hooked onto his head, Marty. I mean it was one of those that you know it, it, he had a, a rubber band for crying out loud, and he's just dabbing it away like he's some kind of um, a genius for coming up with the, a cell phone you stick on your head with a rubber band. Marty, I gotta tell you, some of these people I think we either have way too much time in their hands or one too many chromosomes. So he's quite easy for that. Don't worry about that, okay? Oh, Marty, Marty. The, oh, you're not Marty. I thought you were Marty. I'm sorry. Anyway, hello. Uh, is, Calvin, is Calvin there? Calvin, yeah, he's here. Uh, who should I say is calling? Okay, John Turner, this is a call from Andrew Matthews. From, from who? Andrew Matthews. Andrew, Andrew. Matthews. And what's your last name? Matthews. Martin? Ma Math Matthews, you said, right? Matthews. Okay. No, I said, yeah, Matthews. Yeah. Okay, Andrew Matthews. Okay, hold on. Let me go get him, okay? I'm going to put the phone down. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I could swear that was Marty. Calvin! Okay, thanks, sweetie. I'll go get him. Thank you. Okay, give me one on the phone. Alright, I got it. Thank you. Hello? Hello? Yes, Calvin. Good morning. How are you, sir? Uh, I'm fine. Uh, I can, I can have, I'm having trouble hearing you. Who is this? Okay, my name is Andrew Matthews of the Bay Coast Bank in London. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, you wrote an email that I call you before you can be able to fill out the forms we uh, sent out to you a fortnight ago. Yes, uh, hold on, let me let me see if I can find them real quick. Um, oh, I put them on my computer. I'm trying to think of whose name I would put them under, though. Okay. Um, Thank you. All right, let me look here. Um, oh, I'd probably be better off if I just go to my email real quick here. Let me see. Then I can find the name a lot easier. Okay, was it Barclays Bank? Exactly. Okay. And... I think I sent you about two official forms, and then my identification and a copy of my passport. That's right, okay, here it is. Alright, so the Barclays Bank, okay, um... Alright, number one, uh, the, from, from the first document, I noticed that there was a, a area for a surname and then other name. What's a surname? Yes. Okay, listen, the other names is this. I think you got uh, maybe Catherine, maybe B or C, uh, Hawkins. So the middle name is uh, maybe the initials, and then the last name is the Hawkins. Okay, but what's a surname? The surname is Hawkins. Oh, okay, so that would be my last name is my surname, and then my first name would be the exactly. other name. Exactly. Oh, okay, good. All right, now let's see. There was something else I want to know. Uh, the dress abroad. Yeah, okay, that was for. Okay, now there was a part of here about a compulsory initial deposit of five thousand pounds or two thousand five hundred pounds. 
Yes. Okay, well, what's uh, in a, a compulsory... I'm sorry, go ahead. Okay, this amount now uh, is used to activate your account uh, or the funds which you have here in your account with us. And this money uh, is not coming to back, uh, rather it comes back to you because by the time we'll give you your online account details, uh, which you'll be using to log into your account, you will see that this amount comes back to you automatically. You know, the bank does not have any rights over it. But it's just for us to use it and activate the account, and no one has operated on this account uh, for the past uh, uh, quarter. You know, so this is why it is imperative that we really set up an account in your favor, in your name, giving you your personal details that no other one else has. And uh, with this amount, we are charging from you as activation. From there, we are giving you your MasterCard. We are giving you your ATM card. We are giving you your life insurance policy certificate. And we are also giving you a credit line mortgage. You know, these are the facilities that cover us of this activation fee. But at the end of the day, this money uh, comes also back to you. And why it is necessary to do this activation is so that we can have a personal account pin number issued out to you so that by the time you will be transferring up your funds from the bank to bank, you do not have any restrictions of this whatsoever. Okay. Now, um, yes. now, I, I, if I could, uh, could I just uh, skip the compulsory, compulsory uh, initial deposit and just uh, just get a regular account where I, I don't have to deposit any money into it? Uh, but, uh, there is no account you open with backers without the compulsory initial deposit. There is no account being opened here free. No account at all. Really? There is no free opening of account here in London. Oop, hung up.